I'm going to walk you through some of the powerful and easy to use features available to you once you've made purchases through the audiobookstore.com. Once you purchase an audiobook from the audiobookstore.com or made a previous purchase and are logged into that account, you will have an option called My Library available to you on the page that allows you to manage your devices and downloads. After clicking the My Library link, at first glance you will see that you have the ability to associate a device with your account to make it easier to transfer music to your devices. With a single account, you can register up to three computers and three MP3 devices using the Add Additional Device link to the right of the device drop-down menu. We support almost any MP3 player, MP3 compatible PDA, or MP3 enabled mobile phone including the Apple iPod and iPod Touch, iPhone, iPhone 3G, Microsoft Zune, Palm One Trio, and the Blackberry line to name a few. You can also play audiobooks directly on your PC or Macintosh computer via iTunes, or burn a CD and play in your car CD player. We are also fully integrated with all Apple products, including the iTunes software. With choices and features like these, you have the flexibility to use your digital media as you wish and manage it easily in one convenient online location. Depending on how your My Library filters are set up, and when you originally purchased your audiobooks, you may not see all of your purchases upon first entering the My Library page. If this is the case, under the Program Type drop-down menu, choose All Program Types, and choose All under the Purchase Within menu to show all of the audiobooks in your library purchased to date. You can filter your results further by selecting options within the other drop-down menus to the right of the page. Filter the media type by making a selection from the Program Type drop-down. You can further limit or expand your results by choosing a time increment in the Purchased Within drop-down menu just mentioned. Now that you have your media showing, you can find what you are looking for easily. By clicking on any of the hyperlinks in the table headings, you can sort by that particular criteria. You can sort by date purchased, program title, program type or length, author, and whether downloaded or not. The download indicator is helpful if you've bought an audiobook for later download and use. You can quickly see whether or not you've already downloaded that particular title by looking for the presence of the green check mark in the column. You also have the ability to choose the right format at the right quality for your device. You can choose a larger file at higher quality or a smaller file at lesser quality to save space on your device. You can also set the default file format and type when you configure a new or existing device. For example, if you have a first generation iPod shuffle with only 512 megabytes of total storage space, and you want the device to hold music of an audiobook, you'd likely choose a smaller file size to save space. You'll sacrifice a little in audio quality, but the audiobook will still be very enjoyable. Now, you'll simply click the Downloaded button to download the file to your computer. Once downloaded, you'll have the ability to upload it to your device using the free software available under the Device Center. If you're using an Apple product such as an iPod or an iPhone and have iTunes installed, you should be presented with a window prompting you to download it directly into iTunes. And remember, what you buy is yours. You can download an item multiple times and even after you've canceled your membership, you are still able to log in and download items in my library. If you don't wish to download the content yet or at all, you can have the content streamed directly to your computer while you listen by clicking the stream link. These are just a few of the great features available to you with the audiobookstore.com. To enjoy our great products and services, Go visit our website now at theaudiobookstore.com.